What's going on, y'all? It's the wavy one here, and I'm about to eat dinner. Uh, so, just finished my workout maybe like an hour and a half ago, and this is the meal that I am going to use to get some extra nutrients, extra calories. For the most part, my diet is majority liquids, you know, like three to four liters of fruit juice every day. And then typically on days when I work out, and maybe like Saturday, uh, I'll go ahead and eat a nice big solid meal. So this is plant-based, vegan friendly, all that good stuff. Um, we've got kale in here, I've got cabbage, I've got uh, this little Indian food packet thingy with uh, chickpeas, garlic, you know, some other stuff in there. I've got some plant-based, uh, what is it called? Uh, I can't I can't remember the brand name, but uh, some plant-based meat in here. Uh, I just chopped it up and threw it in here. Um, and then I have some black-eyed peas. Can't remember what I'm even eating. <laughs> black-eyed peas, wild rice, not sprouted. I'm not sprouting anything right now. I'm gonna get back to that in the future, but for now it's just regular. Um, and then topped it off with some mung bean sprouts. They didn't have alfalfa sprouts, so I like these too, so I got them. But uh, yeah, I mean, literally, I made a pot full of food, and here it is right here. Um, it's a pretty good amount of food. I really don't need much, but we all like to eat, right? So yeah, I'm going to have this. I'm going to enjoy it. I'll make sure to post more videos in the future, letting y'all see the type of stuff that I actually eat. Uh, you know, if you are on this plant-based journey, a lot of people say, oh, it's so hard to be vegan, it's so hard to be plant-based, when in reality, it's not. You just probably don't want to cook, and you're going to have to cook. So get used to it, unless you're going to order out all the time, but that adds up. It's just cheaper to make your own stuff. So uh, definitely like, comment, subscribe, and I will catch y'all in the next life.